Yeah. yeah. All right. Take these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. So what? Look, Spin. Um. You didn't tell anybody, did you? Tell anyone what? <laughs> what I said yesterday. At the cafe. Man, after the date with Hazel, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Dude, I, I can't read your mind, so just say it. That I'm gay? Oh, that. <laughs> well, you know, maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Why would he? To make my life a living hell? All right, Spin asked us to keep it a secret till he's thought about it more, so he can't tell anybody, all right? Promise. Keep what a secret? Yeah, what's the big news? Okay, um, page turns 16 in a few weeks, and Spin's planning a surprise party. Yeah, meaning you two can tell no one. Guys, I'll carry the secret to my grave, okay? See you at home room, huh? Oh, sorry. Hey, just wanted to check in. See how you're holding up. Good. I mean, my last meal was 14 hours ago, so I'm a little hungry, but uh, I wasn't going to lunge at it. No, I'm not an animal. So, uh, my mom's picking you up this afternoon? For my biopsy, yes. And you can say leukemia, too, because I don't have it yet. Maybe you should just go home. No. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Besides, uh, Manny's uh, silent auction is at lunch. Nothing says jackpot like a personal ASCII portrait. Hey, look. What do you think? He looks more like me or Spike. He looks like a bunch of code. Actually, I'm gonna look a lot like Jack if chemo has his way. Bald, bald, bald. Why are they teaching us about soil erosion? I'm not a farmer. I'm never gonna be a farmer. It's junior A tickets, I promise. Oh, okay. Hey, nice. You guys still come to see me play? Yeah, I'm yeah. it. All right, see you tonight. Oh, remember, one of those is for Marco. Oh, man. Hockey, the gardens, boys night out. Boys night? Ooh, hockey, ooh, boys night out. Could you two be bigger fags? OK, now I don't know. Who's the bigger weirdo today, Spinner or Marco? Marco, and he's not coming. What, since when does Marco like hockey? He's doing some gay artsy thing with Ellie anyway. Ah, uh, they broke up. Right. Broke up. Funny. Mark. What's this I hear about you bailing on us tonight? Bailing? Yeah, Dylan's game. You're chilling with Ellie, right? It's too bad, man. OK, guys, in your teams, I want you to spread out on either side of the net. This is a volleying drill, meaning I want to see three successful volleys among your own players before putting it over. Let's get started. So what now, huh? What, are you freezing me up with the guys? Why do you want to come anyway? It's hockey, not ballet. Dylan invited me. Yeah, and that's the only reason you want to go. Your big gay crush. You guys gonna gossip or play? Yeah. Let's go. 
go. The side serves first. Gavin, did I say to Spike? A nice going, Spinner. Then volley like I told you. Okay, Matt, you serve. Gavin, change room now. Good thing spin spikes like a girl. Liberty, come on, two dollars? Okay, I guess it could go up to five. You can go up to ten. Come on, Manny's counting on me to bring in the big bucks. Even 50 bucks would be nice. Guys, Looks like someone's already there. Great pause. So I want you to place your bids, and the highest bidders get to spend a day with me. We're going to the Science Center, and it'll be a lot of fun. Okay, here you go. All right. Watch this. Degrassi? <clears throat> Degrassi! I issue you a challenge. Raise 250 bucks by this time tomorrow, and I'll shave my head right here in the foyer. Thank you for asking, people. What's your problem with Marco? What's my problem? That's my problem, okay? And it's true, he told me himself. Marco's gay? Yeah, and if you don't back off, I may start to think you are too. So what are you gonna write next? Something about me being black? Hey, I heard about gym class. You're not gonna take that, are you? What am I supposed to do, Elle? I don't know, get Dylan to use Spinner as a hockey puck tonight? Yeah, I'm not going. Dylan invited you. You have to. Why? Marco, come on. I'm not blind. Go to the game. You better be coming, Del Rossi. Pizza at the dot first, then a night of our national sport. But Spin... Spin's an idiot. Okay, so come. Fine. But I'll meet you at the arena, okay? Because pizza and Spin... Always a bad combo. Yeah. Okay, I'll see you there. No way. I still am my sass. Jimmy. That's the Mabel I said. Whoa, what does tough still mean? Yeah, it's I tough thought you still. might know. I don't know. It's tough still, dude. <laughs> um, I thought this was boys' night. <laughs> for you. For me, it's watch Dylan play hockey for the gazillionth time night. Where's Marco? Spinner? Um, actually, he's gonna meet us at the arena. You wanna go settle a bill? Hun, get over it already. Paige? I've been there with Dylan, and it's hard, I know. Yeah, but Dylan's your brother. You had to deal. And you have to deal with Marco. No, actually, I don't. Okay, I think that's everything. Uh, salad, uh, Sydney seafood jambalaya. I know, sounds suspect, but the omega-3 fatty acids will do wonders for Snake's immune system. Cool. Salad, bread, and dessert. Okay, we should uh, go before they arrive. Right. That was a pain in the surprise. What are you guys doing here? Uh, we just thought we'd drop off some food and now we're gonna leave because we know you've had a hard day. What? No, but this? No, it's nothing. Stay, stay. Archie, come on. You're exhausted. No, I'm not. Fine, but I want you to sit. Oh, sit. Right, yeah. The biopsy was from my pelvic bone, so uh, I won't be complaining about hemorrhoids anytime soon. That was a joke. You know, I'm, I'm not dead yet. Snake. What? What? We got good food, my friends are here, and I just had marrow taken out of my butt, so sue me if I want to have a good time. Come on! Let's get this party started! Food smells great. Hey, Jim, it's Marco. I got off at the wrong stop. I know, I just turned on the church street. I'll be there soon. 
Chao. What, are you lost? Huh? No, actually I'm just meeting some friends for a hockey game. <laughs> Boy's not out in uh, Boy's Town, huh? Huh? Uh. Huh? Hmm? Uh, yeah. Actually, I think I can find it, thanks. Look, I don't care what you want, faggot! Do you know what I want? No, no, it's you being a loser. Look, if Marco gets here before I get back, just don't act like a psycho. Uh, yes, Mom, I'll be nice to your girlfriend. You are pretty, aren't you? Yes. Almost, almost girl pretty. <laughs> oh, I think that's his boyfriend. But I think, answer it. Answer it, come on. Answer it! Guys, help me, I'm oh, in the no, box! Marco! Marco! Don't move. You'll be okay. Don't move. Just stay. Just stay. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Hey, it's Marco Sell. Just do your thing. Ciao. It looks okay. You're gonna be all right. You're gonna be okay. That's it. Marco! Hey, 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 hey. Marco, okay. I'm a friend. Don't worry. Your friend's gonna be just fine, all right? We'll get the creeps that did this to him. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. You're gonna be okay. You're gonna be just fine. It's all right. I'm here and I'm not going anywhere, okay? You're all right. You're gonna be okay. Big news, Degrassi. Mr. Simpson's spur of the moment fundraiser, a huge success. So after school in the foyer, there's gonna be some head shaving going on. Nice to know someone in your family has a sense of humor, Emma. So you're walking through the gay village alone at night and you get sworn for your shoes? That's what happened. Look, you don't believe me, Elle? Whatever. I don't. You should talk to the police. I did, last night. And your parents? What don't you get, Elle? With Finn and after last night, I am not telling anybody anything ever again. So what? You're just gonna pretend? No, I'm just... I'm just not gonna be anything, okay? Gay or straight. And so what about Dylan? Ellie, just drop it, please. It's over. Wow, I really did a number on you. Yeah. Marco, look, I'm fine, okay? So just leave me alone. Shave Shave Sister Susan, thanks so much for doing this. The squad owes you. Yeah, a toupee. So, who's the lucky hairdresser? Woo! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I spent 10 years 
fires filleting caught out on the Grand Banks, Princess. <laughs> Hands steady as a surgeon. Where do you think you go? Remember, guys, uh, bald is beautiful. Thanks for coming out and supporting the Junior Spirit Squad fundraiser. Even you got to admit that was cool. OK, what now, Em? How have I offended you this time? Emma, what is it? Nothing. Then why do you look like you're going to cry? Home's not too good right now, okay? Is it the baby? Are your, are your parents fighting? Snake is sick and it might be bad. But they're just doing tests. There might be nothing wrong at all, right? Yeah, he's gonna be fine, Em. I know it. Didn't touch the rim. So 16 to 4, extra point pour moi. Dude, I know basketball's not your game, but come on, at least try. Oh, what's that, 16 to 5? No. no, it's not, because this is 21 we're playing. You shoot and you score. There are no layups. Oh, well, we must follow all the rules to the letter, or Mr. Teacher will get mad. Dude, you're worse than Marco. What's bugging you now? What's bug? The guy gets a black eye, and it's the end of the world. Oh, oh my God! Hey, look, you weren't there last night when I found him, okay? <laughs> okay, calm down, hero. Just relax. You're such a loser. Why? Because I'm not all broken up over Marco and his stolen dancing shoes. Look, if he would have walked to the game with us, none of that would have happened. Last night was his fault, not mine. So, was it the hospital? And... Better get used to the new look. My first round of chemo's in a couple days. It looks pretty sexy, I think. You know, give me some fancy duds, buy me a new sports car, I'll be styling. Em, don't cry. Don't cry. There's nothing to cry about. Snake, you have cancer. You're sick, and you're always just so calm, or joking, or shaving your head like nothing's wrong. Because I have to be like this, Emma, if I'm going to beat it. And are you? Yes. I promise you and Jack and your mom. Yes. Hey, Marco. I always knew you and Dylan were meant for each other. What? <laughs> hmm. 
No, huh? You didn't tell anybody my secret did you spin. I don't need this. Man, all I did was tell you the truth. I never asked you to. And just like I didn't ask to be gay. Or you didn't ask to like the age, or Craig didn't ask to like Ash. It's not the same. No. You get it easy. Then stop being gay. All right, Spin, I'm just gonna go do that. Well, why not? It's not like you've actually done anything yet. Not that I need to know. Spin. And nobody else needs to know either. I mean, you can try dating Hazel, for real. Why not? Even strangers know, Spin. And last night wasn't about my shoes. Those guys, they knew. And they bashed me because they hate it. Just like you do. Dude, that's brutal, but you can't compare me to those guys. Really? Why not? My Wubby and Zage just buy stock in the photo company. They ordered like two dozen prints. Are they blind? <laughs> See that guy, Jay? 100% pure psycho. Park there, you'll get a ticket. Ooh, not a ticket. Hey, give those back. What are you, his bodyguard? His friend. Spell check. Try it sometime. He's in a great mood. He started chemo last week. Oh. Sorry. It's okay. The laptop was a surprise for mom to cheer him up. Because <laughs> nothing says happy like a new computer. <laughs> True, if you're Archie Simpson. Did you call last night? There were some hang-ups. No, it wasn't me. I was thinking, why don't we get together tonight? You know, watch some TV, order a pizza, like we used to. I don't know if I can. Come on. A movie, a couch, double cheese, me. How could I resist? Hey, what's up? and peanut sauce. <laughs> Hello, vitamins. Hello, tastes good. Emma, they're calling a sub. I'm going home. Not feeling well? Your mom's stuck at the salon tonight, so you gotta come straight home after school. I can't. Sean and I are... are gonna have to reschedule. <sighs> you guys ever hear of babysitters? Sean. Yeah, I know. It just... No. Whoa, en passant, you can't do that. Oh, I can. A rare but legal move of opportunity by the lonely pawn. Toby, is everything okay? JT was supposed to be here. Then why is he sitting over there? 
He probably forgot today's the inaugural meeting of the Rooks and Knights Society. Hey, JT, <laughs> over here. <laughs> Yeah, he really forgot. Hope he hasn't forgotten he's staying over at my place tonight. Check, meeting for. Uh. Hmm. Put that in there like that. When I tried doing that with the wrench, it just got looser. Maybe you should stick to selling cars. Hey, shut up. Man, this was supposed to be my bird course for the semester. I don't know many birds that can change a transmission. Ah. Nice job, Sean. You can work my pit any day. Sean? What's his problem? Okay. Don't mess with him, man. You're doing that wrong. Okay, sorry. Try removing the injector line first. Ready, tidy. Lefty Lucy. Got guts, Cameron. Now, in an obtuse triangle, one angle is greater than 90 degrees, whereas in a scalene triangle. You see Sean Cameron, please? Sure, Sean. Someone broke into a vending machine near your locker. Did you see anything? No. Really? Some students said that they saw they you. They saw me what? I'm just trying to get to the bottom of this. So that points to me, the poor kid. That's not what I said. Then what are you saying? Watch your tone. Sean, I'm just trying to get to the bottom of this. Well, I'm not at the bottom of it. The way you're acting, I'm beginning to think that maybe you are. I'm watching you, Mr. Cameron. What's your problem? You! Radish is all over me because of that stupid vending machine. Did you tell him anything? No, but he thinks I did it. Ooh, I'm in trouble with Radish. I'm gonna get a detention. Technically, it's not Walker City property. Fight was off school grounds. Just get a warning. Don't talk to me. You handle yourself pretty good. I said don't talk to me. Look at you. All M&M on the outside. Big scared baby on the inside. I've got a record, OK? You're that guy, aren't you? You nearly killed a kid in Wasega. It was a fight, and I deafened him in one ear. Sorry, what? I can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're a real comedian for someone sitting in the principal's office. Chair's got my imprint in it. Look, you ever want to hang with some real people? Your people? Not geeks. You let me know. Jason, you first. In my office now. Liberty. Liberty. 
JT, get up. We're gonna be late. Toby, quit it! Stop! Would you feel bed or something? You had a wet dream? Three feet above my head? Can you keep it down? What was it about? Your mom. It was Liberty, wasn't it? Liberty. Liberty. Toby, I swear, if you tell anyone, I'll slaughter you. Okay, shooter. So, time do we meet the cool kids for lunch? Lunch? So, no, no, you're not having lunch with us, okay? <laughs> oh, yes, I am. Unless you want everyone to find out about your, uh, sticky situation. Cold air intake. Yeah. How did you know? It's a simple mod. Sucks air into the engine, adds about five horses. You know your cars. You don't. It's loose. <laughs> now, a cold air intake's a start, but if you really want to tweak this, add a full cap back system. It's a pipe running from the catalytic converter to the exhaust. Adds about 15 horsepower. Sweet. How much? In parts, a few hundred. The parts ain't cheap, but if you want, I can do the labor for free. What you say? Said if you got flows and skills, and if you got mad rhythm, would you give me the chill so I can feel stimulated in the back of my brain, and I can see where you're coming from and hear what you're saying? I can't believe. <laughs> Trump 9, but it does not beat the left bower. I, I don't understand. I mean, Trump, bower, euchre, is this even English? Actually, euchre is an English word, but its origins are unknown. Love euchre. Always play with my bubby. Feel me in. I'm Toby Isaacs. I know everything. It's just making an observation. Really? Would you like to hear my observation, Toby? No one cares. Well, I know something everyone here might care about. Toby. The nocturnal emission, better known as the wet dream. I've had them. Spinner's had them. Even uh, Mr. Radich has had them. OK, I, I so did not need that mental image. No one else has had them? Hey, guys, let's get back to the cards. J.T. York. OK, is there a point to this? Oh, there's a point. Right there. OK, that may make sense in Yiddish, but I'm still lost. So is JT this morning, in dreams of liberty. Gross, can we change the topic? No way, this is such juicy gossip. Oh, pardon the pun. <laughs> <laughs> We have one hour to pick up each and every last piece of garbage. Remember, guys, today we're gonna clean the ravine! Yeah. Yeah. Woohoo! Yeah. 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 This is how you're gonna spend lunch? Picking up garbage? I promised I'd help out. Fine, help out. We're going for a drive. I'll meet you up there, right. okay? Sean, I was thinking you and I could start on the Northeast Slope. Uh oh. Chemical spill. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go start. Great sense of humor. Look, man, it's your choice. You can come for a ride or clean the ravine. Want a drink? Thanks for helping. I know this isn't exactly your idea of fun. Only half an hour left, so. Sean, <laughs> we have to. The garbage isn't going anywhere. Oh, 
lot, lot of garbage. <laughs> Emma. Anybody could walk by. Who cares? I do. See you in class. Fine. Be like that. Like what? Sulky. <sighs> You're so uptight. Why? Because I didn't want to, like, make out in front of other people? No, because you never want to do anything. Not with me. I just spent my entire lunch with you. Yeah, cleaning the ravine. Well, sorry that I care about stupid, unimportant things like the environment. That's all you care about. Emma Nelson, environmental crusader, a babysitter, a nurse. The snake has cancer, Sean. Yeah, I heard. Fine. Tomorrow, you spend lunch with those losers. You know what? I will. Because at least they're fun. Fun? And you? You're just pathetic. This is not a barnyard. I am not your mother, so clean up, OK? All of you who have cleaned up, get out of here. Righty tidy, lefty Lucy, huh? Hey, remember the cat back system? I've been working on a scheme to get the cash. Yeah? It's pretty good. Good. Let's do it. Don't you need permission from the boss? She's not my boss. Let's go. All right. I'll vic it. You guys make sure the janitors are occupied. <clears throat> Yo. The keyboard will get you 50 bucks, if you're lucky. Now that. <laughs> That'll buy you a capback system. Since it was your idea. should be in the back. Sean? Can I talk to you for a minute? Alone? No. Go ahead and talk. We're all interested. <laughs> it's about yesterday. We both said a lot. I was hoping we could talk, really talk, about everything. Got nothing to say. How could you do that? Me? What about the way you've been acting? You told them I had a wet dream over liberty. You treated me like crap for no reason. You stood me up for lunch. You act like I'm some big loser. What did I do to you? OK. They're my friends. You're my friend. But you and them. Never going to happen. Topes. Topes. Topes, wait up. Let's have lunch together today, OK? 
What's the matter? My, my, my new laptop, I, I thought I left it locked in here last night. I mean, I know the chemo's making me stupid, but I can't believe I actually lost it. Maybe it's not the chemo.